consumer products sold under the Teflon brand are safe. DuPont did, in fact, ask EPA to make those statements, correct? That's correct. When I was pregnant with Bucky, I worked for DuPont around Teflon. They tried to blame me. They said it was something that I did. The more they would tell me that, the more suspicious I got. You did see there was a substantial risk to the women at the DuPont plant. There was no potential risk to the women. There was a potential risk to the fetus. It was used in consumer products, manufacturing products, and the applications were endless. These Teflon and Scotchgard chemicals permeated the living world. Today, every baby is born with Teflon chemicals in their blood. DuPont and another company called 3M had been studying this chemical dating back to the 1950s and 1960s. Did you work with a lot of other people that have been sick or died early? Carol Kaplan, Jim Broadwater, Joy Weaver, Steve Bailey, Lona Carr. They are aware of the risk of the product. Risk is relative. If I go out here and sprinkle arsenic around, they'd arrest me for murder. You've lied, and they're still lying. Everybody in this area, in one way or another, is connected to DuPont. You go dealing with somebody's livelihood, you're going to have problems. There was a discussion about, do we need to come up with something in our production that's not going to cause these problems? They conclude, if we launch something new, it's going to cost us a lot of money. We have to stick with the devil we know. Was I a guinea pig? What do you think? 